Hey everyone, today we're going to go over creating your own custom markups and saving them to your tool chest in Review 2018. As you know, the tool chest is one of Review's most productive features as it contains markups and symbols that can be re reused quickly. This really makes your workflow a lot quicker and easier. The great part is you are not limited to using what you see in Review. You can create your own markup tools in any version of Review, which can also be shared with other Bluebeam users. So let's go ahead and begin. As an example of a custom tool, um, let's say we want to grab the pen tool here, and I'll just use my sh keyboard shortcut to open up the pen. Um, let's just say we want to draw this, this squiggly line here. Nothing fancy, I just want to use it as an example. Now that it's drawn, let's say we're going to use this on other documents. All you're going to do is you're going to right click it, add to tool chest. Now you'll see my list is very long just because I have a lot of tool sets installed. Yours will more than likely be a lot shorter and you'll definitely have my tools. So I'm going to add it to my tools. You'll see here it was added to my list of tools. What that means is every time I open review, this tool that I've created will be saved in my tool chest for future use. So anytime I click on it, I can add it to that document that I'm in. So that really allows you to customize your tool sets. Let's say, um, you know, we don't want to draw our own tool. You see this toilet on this document and you know you're going to want to use that image on other projects or documents. Um, we can take an image of that image and save it to our tool sets and create a tool out of it. To do that, you're going to want to use your snapshot tool, which is going to be the letter G on your keyboard. You can also find it under the edit menu here. It's the snapshot tool. What you're going to do is you're going to draw a square or rectangle around the image, depending on how big it is. It's going to flash at us, letting us know when it's done. And what you can do now is you can paste that onto the document. So now you see I pasted it here. So what that allows us to do now is right click, same as we did with that squiggly line, and add to our tool chest. And again, it's available for future use. While we're in the tool chest, um, let me just cover really quick uh, the difference between recent tools and my tools. Recent tools is going to display any tools that you've used while in the program. Um, keep in mind, once you close review, it is going to clear it out. So it's just going to save whatever you've been doing while you had the program open. Once you close it, it's going to be completely cleared out. So if there's something that you want to save, um, something that I like to save is my signature or you know anything that I frequently use on several documents, make sure you're saving to my tools. That way you don't have to create them every single time you're in, a, in review. Um, and that's it. Now you know how to create custom tools in Bluebeam Review. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us by phone at 480-559-8670 or email us at obc at uscad.com and we'd be happy to help. Thank you.